Welcome back to Good Day Stateline. We've got a little over 20 of uh, 24, 48 hours in film 2022. Uh, we need the perfect drink to ring in the new year, and we have found the perfect person to tell us what we should be drinking on Friday night. Sarah Tracy, she is a Martha Stewart living contributor, a wonderful sommelier. Hi, Sarah. Hello. I'm so excited always to talk to you, especially because you send me wine. <laughs> Absolutely, and I do think that a lot of people this year are deciding to forego the big night out of the club or the bar for New Year's and right. really have a cozy night at home. So I thought it'd be fun to bring you some wines that I think are really perfect for that type of celebration. I am so excited about this. Champagne is one of my favorites, Bubblies. And I also love uh, this can of wine the most. When I first opened this box, I was like, hold on a second. Did she just send a can of Bubbles? Tell us about this. <laughs> I think people will be surprised by this, but yes, I do recommend these awesome cans of sparkling wine. They're from 14 Hands Winery in Washington State. And they're just really fun. Believe it or not, there's two and a half glasses of wine mm -hmm. in one of these cans. So pop one of these, you're kind of good to go for the evening. And I really love these single serve options, especially for doing more of like a socially distanced kind of hang this year. Sure. Um, I love that we can just have these little minis and they're awesome for New Year's Day brunch too. I know personally, I'm not planning on stopping at the sparkle party at midnight. I'm gonna keep it going into New Year's Day. These are great for brunch. Do you hear that? It opens, it's, it's very bubbly when it opens too. And smells good. Also, I like this because even though for the most of us, you know, we don't pop a bottle of champagne and then put it back in the fridge, but every once in a while that does happen. But if you're opening the cans, then you're never gonna let that bottom of the bottle go bad. Absolutely, and if you're kind of not sure about the can, these are really great too. Um, these are little mini bottles, but they are aluminum, so they're lightweight and they're totally recyclable. And I love them, you can actually screw the cap back on, so no problems with flat bubbles over here. These are from Chateau Saint Michel, which is Washington State's founding winery. And I just think these are really fun. They come in like a little two pack for a smaller gathering. And I like to make a cocktail with these. So I have like just a little pomegranate cheese and some fresh cranberries mixed with the bubbles and just keep it, you know, a little festive with a nice cocktail or a punch. These are perfect for that. I know these are so cute too. And the two pack is perfect, especially if you're just, you know, stopping by somewhere and you want to bring like a little gift too for the Sweet. the bubbly holiday that is just a few days away. Now you also want to tell us about two bottles of wine um, that are full size regular bottles of wine that maybe are good hostess gifts or just good to have around the house as we ring in 2022. Yeah, not everyone is a fan of sparkling wine. I know you and I are totally <laughs> we are. with it. <laughs> Apparently, some people would prefer red wine. And so I brought a Cabernet Sauvignon from H3 Winery in the Horse Heaven Hills, again in Washington. And Washington State is a fabulous source for amazing value. This bottle, I think to me, I would blind taste it against a California Cabernet that maybe costs four times as much. And I would consider this to be every every bit of quality here. So this is a really fun one to bring for a host gift. I love the label is really, really stunning and just a really nice red to have on hand by the fire. Yeah, I've had that one. It's delicious. I loved it. And then if anyone is more of a white wine fan, this is really cute. This white wine you sent to the Liquid Light Sauvignon Blanc. Yeah, and I think we all know the biggest trend this holiday is charcuterie boards. Mm -hmm. And I think with, with cheese and charcuterie, those kind of rich, savory meats and creamy cheeses, I love a crisp, refreshing white wine to kind of cut through all that richness. Uh, the Liquid Light Sauvignon Blanc is a favorite of mine this year. It's really zesty and fresh, and it only has 95 calories in glass, so you can have an extra piece of cheese Ooh, or two and not that. feel guilty about it. All right, Sarah, where can we get um, our hands on all of these wines or more information on you? They should all be at your local liquor store or grocery store or wine shop. And you can also get them on Drizzly, the Drizzly app. They'll just deliver them right to your door. All right, well, cheers to you, Sarah. This is my first uh, cheers to the new year. <laughs> it started early, I love it. Thank you so much for joining us. We'll be right back with game day.